Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Amidst the ongoing conflict in Ukraine, there's a proposal to address German reluctance in supplying long-range cruise missiles to Ukraine. The United Kingdom and Germany are exploring a potential missile swap. Berlin would send Taurus missiles to the UK, allowing the UK to provide more Storm Shadow missiles to Kyiv. Chancellor Olaf Scholz's Germany maintains opposition to directly delivering Taurus missiles to Ukraine, citing concerns about escalation with Russia and missile technology control regime restrictions. The Taurus Kept 350 missile, boasting a 500 km range and a 495 kg payload, is central to this debate, its advanced tech appealing to Ukrainian forces combating Russian aggression. However, concerns loom over potential conflict escalation and technical complexities, including modifying Ukrainian aircraft for Taurus deployment. The missile swap idea surfaced in January, inspired by NATO's Ringtausch initiative supplying military gear to Ukraine. Despite its allure, opposition arises, notably from Marie Agnes Strack Zimmerman, Bundestag's Defense Committee Chair, stressing Taurus's vital role for Ukraine and citing technical hurdles. Yet, British Foreign Secretary David Cameron hinted at ongoing discussions, cautious about revealing plans to adversaries. He refuted claims that supplying Taurus missiles to Ukraine would escalate tensions, proposing usage restrictions. Simultaneously, German Foreign Minister Annalena Baerbock signaled openness to the proposal, deeming it a viable option. This follows months of advocacy for sending Taurus missiles to Kyiv. Germany's reluctance to directly provide advanced Taurus missiles, capable of striking targets from afar and evading detection, underscores the complexity of decisions regarding military aid for Ukraine. As Kyiv seeks more advanced weaponry for defense, negotiations between London and Berlin could offer a way to bolster Ukraine's military capabilities without escalating tensions with Russia. That's all for now. See you later.